Thank you, Father. Where's Terry? Terry, where are you, Angel? Come here, baby. Put my things back where I can get my guitar. Just put that back. We had something messed up, but I feel like doing this. Is all right with you, Jan? Okay. You know, I could do this for hours, so I'm used to it. But, excuse me, sound man. I hope it didn't pop this. Terry's going to join me. Is this an awesome gift? You know, when you see the Lord take a young man like Terry, knowing some of his past, and he's not ashamed to let you know that, what the Lord has done. Well, of course, we're all ashamed of why we did it, but we aren't ashamed to tell of the miracle of how God changed us. I watch Terry, and I say, God, before you take me home, let me be on stage and let me dance with a good leg while Terry plays the harp. I believe one day I will, Terry. Amen. I believe that. I'm in the key of D. We're just going to do something together. Are you with me there, honey? Okay. We, all right. We're going to just kick it like I showed you. You want to count it? Or I'll count it. I'll just do the kick off. Okay. I feel the touch of hands so kind and tender. They're leading me in paths that I must try. I'll have no fear, cause Jesus walks beside me.
when Terry didn't know there was a God out there on drugs and in the world. He was sheltered in his arms. When I didn't know I had a friend in the whole world, I was in his arms. When I left home and I was just 12 years old and caught an old bus somewhere in Kentucky, I was in his arms. When my daddy was dying on his deathbed, I led him to Jesus. And now he's shaved, safe in the arms of Jesus. No matter where you're hurting out there in television land or sitting here tonight, you're in his arms. Alcoholic laying in that hotel room, no matter what you've done, darling, you're in his arms. You yeah. can't get away from that. Your little girl that just aborted that baby, you're still in his arms and he still loves you. That little baby that doesn't have a home, somewhere there's a mom and daddy that's going to put you in their arms and love you. You're sitting in your chair alone tonight and your companion's gone. You're still in the arms of the Lord. I've always known he was there. I was safe in his arms. If I have to walk alone, I'm not alone. Will you marry me, Dottie? And then he took me in his arms. We had a, a wedding here. But soon we're going to have a wedding there. What a day it's going to be when I'll be forever in his arms. Oh, Jan, I want to see you and Paul there. But I want to see Jesus first and just lay in his arms. Now, if you don't know Jesus tonight and you doubt every preacher that ever preached and you don't have confidence in anybody, have confidence in the God that you're seeing right now, not me, but have confidence in the feeling that's coming over you right now. And I feel like Paul, every telephone across this country is lighting up on every TBN station. They're coming to Jesus right now. Call in, tell somebody, I need the Lord. I need the Lord. I'm out of reach. But you're not out of reach. You're right in reach of those big arms of Jesus. Hallelujah. Just give yourself to the Lord right now. Call in and somebody will pray for you. Now just fall back, relax in him. You are sheltered in his arms. 